uh, I've spent a uh, majority of my career in a shared services industry. So 80% mm -hmm. of my career is actually focused on shared services. Mm -hmm. um, 10% in the controllership and finance function. Mm -hmm. And um, the rest of the 5% would go to the academy and marketing. As the Maxim says, no, um, it's better late than never. Um, I took up accountancy as my um, second course. Yes, and my first course, yes, my first course was business management. Yeah, so uh, uh, I found out that accountancy was a better fit for me uh, when I was already working. Back then, when I took up my first uh, course, um, I was a happy-go-lucky folk. When you say happy-go-lucky, well, um, like you're an ordinary teenager, you, know? um, you don't give much focus on your education. Um, well, it's all about fun, parties, vices, um, you know, I, I was uh, conformed with the worldly um, um, stuff. And then I realized the value of, of the education because I, when I found myself in my first work, everyone was like talking behind my back. I don't know what to do really. Um, I had a support system, but you know, I still don't get get my work outputs done as expected. Mm -hmm. So that was, should I say, the turning point of my life, which I ended up taking up another course, accountancy. So one advice is they need to um, invest in themselves, mm -hmm. right? Um, not just technically, but you know, um, you know, they need to know how to negotiate, pitch themselves at work. They need to work on um, the non-qualitative aspects of work, the soft skills like communication, um, managing, managing people, managing your stakeholders, your bosses, your downlines. My name is Dennis De Silva. I am a service delivery manager of ANZ Manila GSO. I am a professional of the future and I am part of the next big thing in the accounting industry. Brought to you by Professionals of the Future.